I actually looked at her and I was like, they've taken the dog. A 13 week old puppy was stolen right out of a Cape Coral yard. This all happened just after seven o'clock this morning. The owners say the dog hopped the fence and made its way to the front of the house on Southeast 9th Place. This is right off Country Club Boulevard. Only NBC 2's Gage Golding is speaking with the owner who says if it weren't for these cameras, they would have thought the dog ran away. I was getting their food ready. I let them run around. It's the morning routine in this now quite hectic household in the cave. Around 7 a.m., Alyssa Boykin lets out her dog Maggie and her new puppies. They usually stay in the backyard. This little fence does a good job of corralling the pups, but just like bad weeds, they just keep growing and growing to the point where now. There are little escapee artists, and they do not like to stay in the fence, and they will jump the fence. It's what happened within minutes of being let out Wednesday morning. Three of the four puppies escaping to the front yard where a man in an SUV spotted them. You could see that he got out and they viewed them. Her camera's recording them driving by not once, not twice, but three times. You can see he's crouching down and he's kind of luring them. Uh, we would say by 725, he was gone. Her daughter came outside only to find three puppies and a distraught mama. The man in his car dog napping this pup named Waylon. She knew something was wrong this morning and she kind of was looking around. How do they lay their head on their pillow at night knowing that they've taken someone's animal. They called Cape Coral Police, who's keeping an eye out. Unfortunately, though, dog napping happens more than you think. Earlier this year, a fired nanny stole this dog in Fort Myers. And without these little ones being chipped, there's truly no way to find them. Please just bring Waylon back to us. We just want our dog back. If you're this person and you bring Waylon back, the family says they won't even press charges. They're even offering a $250 reward. If you do have him, just bring him back to us and all will be said and done. No questions asked. Reporting local tonight in Southeast Cape Coral, Gage Golding, NBC2.